you guys how's it going it's a height here and we're back with a brand new episode of craftimation 101 in the last episode we started making a bunch of iron resources over here this little guy is making us all of the iron stuff we got iron ingots we got magnets we got plates we got charged plates and i think that's all the iron stuff then we started making some wood and we thought out some ancient ice. Now, what I would like to do today, if I am able, is get someone, this bot here perhaps, Bib the Bad, get him going and start making some trees. Now, what I want to work on before any of that, actually, is I want to get some more seeds. So we can also maybe get up there and get this guy. So let's just really quickly thaw out an area so that we can grab this guy. We can get these batteries out of here. Do I have a place to put batteries yet? Doesn't look like it. I'm kind of just storing them on the ground right now. So we're going to move this somewhere where... It's going to be a little bit more useful. Take that, take that. What is this? An actual storage. Just a brand new storage. We're going to need to keep this fired up or we're going to have a problem. Okay, that guy's done. Let's put him in here. And we'll try and store all these batteries so that they're not taking up space on the map. Okay, that looks good. Let's take this, put it away. And I may as well go down here. Let's see if we can get that seed. That's kind of what we're trying to do. I may as well gather whatever else we're able to get from this spot as well. So let's get rid of this guy. What is this? Speedy Ale. I don't know what this is, but we're going to want it. I don't know how to move entire inventories, so we're going to have to do it the uh, slow and steady way. Okay, we got all that stuff out of there. I did go ahead and put another seed up here, starving for water. Let me just move this somewhere a little bit more out of the way. We don't need these chest pieces right away and I guess I probably should have put this stuff somewhere else as well because it's kind of making it tough for our guys to get around anyway I guess it's fine for now we'll let it go I do want to get up here and get this guy hopefully we can grab that relatively quickly I might be able to grab these batteries here as well while we're up here. Let's grab those. Okay. I may as well start putting these storages into something as well. And we'll put that guy there. Okay. Now, what do I want to do with this wood? It's not in a good spot right now. And I guess what I could do is just move this up. And then I guess they'll go around. Hopefully that's fine. Is this going to be... Uh-oh. Uh-oh. <laughs> I just got all of my fire stuck in there. Oh, no. That's okay. We'll make a new fire really quick. We'll get our fires back. And I guess... I'm going to need to put these somewhere else. Okay, we'll put them in there for now. All right, so let's check out our things that we can buy. Our new upgrades. Direction, I still don't know what I need that for. Compares the object carried by Craftmate with an object on the map and follows one of two branches depending on the result. I don't know what we're going to need that for either. Is empty I want though. I have to wait to check whether the selected tile storage bonfire contains stored object. If storage holds an object, the program will proceed. 
All right, so I think we're gonna wanna do this just so that I can do this. Check plant. Craft to make to check on growing organics. Is buff, tells craft to make to check whether craft to make is buffed by an ale. All right, I think this is actually what we want. So now I should be able to grab this guy. We're going to want to do the energy check. Uh, ooh boy, there's so many things here. So we're going to do the energy check first thing. Then refuel if not okay. And if it is okay, we're going to want to find and pick up. Come on, let go. Find and pick up water and ooh, how do I do this now? Is buffed check plant tells craftmate to check a plant's status and proceed with the program. Okay, so we're gonna pick up a water and then we're going to check this plant. I mean, it doesn't matter, I'll just pick one. If it's starving, we will go to it and drop. Uh, drop to there. If it's growing, we can check a new plant. And if it is starving, let's go to the left one next. And if it is starving, let's copy this. Then we want to water that. And then... One more time, if it is growing, we want to check the last plant. And there we go. And if it's growing, what do we want to do? Just idle? To idle. And then I think all of these should go to idle because it's going to start over for us. Okay, so that should work, I think. This guy's just going to water plants all day every day bingo okay now this guy we want him to basically do the same thing the other guy was doing we're gonna do energy check not energy check is it energy check yeah we're going to refuel if low and then if okay we want to basically check all three of these things for if they're ready to harvest or not so we'll check the first one if it is ripe then we want to pick from if it is right we want to pick from it and we actually want to do that twice and then drop to here and then do this again so repeat repeat whoops repeat start next we'll do that whole thing and then i forget what previous is for use previous to start the next cycle you can see the total count of the cycles above the target count I think that's all we have to do is just this and then we're gonna end to idle then what we have to do is copy this whole thing paste it and that is going to be if it is starving or growing and then we got to check all of these is the left side that can be the same repeat next ones and then this is going to be the right side and drop to the same thing repeat to idle and then i guess i don't really need 
these because we can just use one idle node. And then these are also going to go to idle. I think. Hey, Karumba. I mean, I think it's going to work. So let's see. He's looking at there. It's ripe. Why isn't he harvesting it? We'll never know. If it is ripe, he's supposed to be picking. I don't know why this guy is not picking. Pick from. Is there like a harvest? Pick from tells craftmate to pick an object from a selected tile. Maybe there is something else that I need to actually harvest from a tile. Um, what do we got for options here? Variable function smart find unlocks a node that allows craftmates to be instructed to search for items in storage on the ground or wherever. Hmm. Do we try that? I don't know. Variable logic, basic interaction, unlocks a set of nodes that allow craftmates to pause themselves or other craftmates along with an ability to feed other craftmates and wait. Okay. Well, I mean, for now, I guess I can just take the wood off of these things. I think the other programs are working the way they're supposed to. Tree is starving for water. Why aren't you watering it? Well, you are watering it. Okay. Well, that's fine. Then I guess for now, I'll just manually put the wood in here. I'm not sure why this is not working. I wonder if I just set this guy to be find wood. If he'll pull wood out when, once I empty this inventory. Let's see what happens. Okay, so I've emptied the wood. I'm not sure why he won't pick, but now that I've emptied it, maybe we can get him to put wood in somewhere else. Where did that guy go? Kick? Kick the mad? I think that's the guy we want. So instead of doing... Oh, see? He is picking up wood for this one, or he's supposed to be. Why is he not doing it for this one? He's like picking up a seed instead. How do you tell him to pick, pick an object from a selected tile? I'm not sure why he's picking up seed. Okay, well anyway, we'll play around with it more after. Once I actually have a need for wood, I'm sure things are going to be a little bit different. Okay, there we go. What do we get? Another furnace? Okay, now we have two furnaces. What's going on here? You need light bulbs. How do we make light bulbs? Radio lamp is... Lenses and charged plates. And now we don't have any lenses right now, but we could make some pretty easily, I think. We just need to make sand, then we can make lenses, make some charged plates, and now we have radio lamps. We're gonna need 10 of those, so I could get a robot to do this, but... I don't know. I think for now we'll just make them by hand. What the heck did I just make? A heater. I didn't want to make a heater. <laughs> that is not what I was trying to make. All right, one more. I know we could set up an automated guy for this, but I think just to get us through the level, I'll make a few by hand. Man, we have so many of these furnaces. I just don't have wood for them all right now, so we're gonna need to start setting up something for that. Let me get a storage. I'm gonna start just plunking these things into storage. Because I'm kind of running out of room. 
So we're going to need a guy to pick up wood and fill up those furnaces. So that can be this guy's job. Actually, wait, this guy's already looking for wood. I think what we need to do is just delete this whole code. We're going to do a energy check, obviously, our classic refuel. And then all we're going to do is find and pick up. Find and pick up wood. And then we can do that again. Find and pick up wood. And then what do we want to do? Is empty? Tells Craftman to check whether selected tile storage bonfire contains stored objects. Uh, compare count. Tells Craftman. Okay, we'll do this one, and we'll say if that is less than two, then we want to go there and drop. Drop to if it's less than. Drop to there. Okay. And then if it's equal to, we will just go to idle for now. We can add more furnaces in this spot after. So he should be able to find wood now. Perfect. He's finding the wood. Putting it in. Why is he not? I guess we need to get him to drop two. Drop two. Drop to drop to. There we go. Let's put that in here as well. And we're going to need to restart the program so that he's doing what he needs to do. Okay, he needs fuel, so we'll deal with that first. And then once he eats a couple pieces of fuel, he should go pick up a piece of wood, pick up another piece of wood, and go check this guy. Bingo. Bingo. Why is he taking it back out? Oh, no, 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 no. Okay, we're going to have to add a go to point in here somewhere. Um, I guess we'll put it right here. Go to point. And then I'll just get him to go and stand over by the wood. <laughs> there. Now he's going to find proper wood. Kind of. Okay, and I guess while that's happening, I may as well try to burn some more of this ancient, ancient crap out of the way. We got some extra batteries here, which is good. I may as well take those and put them into our storage. And we're getting close to the sulfur. I just got a grab all these. I wish there was a way to grab a fat stack of these things all at once. Okay, where's my storage for containers? Right down there? Perfect. Almost there. I think what we're gonna do is move this guy up here in a second. I don't know. Maybe I just need this to be a little closer. I think I actually do. Do we have a recipe for batteries yet? Plates and... Is that water? Just plates and water? That's not so bad. Charged plates and water. Why is this guy... Not making us charged plates? Or maybe he is. I think he is. It's just I used up a whole bunch of them earlier. We might need to increase our productions of that here shortly. How did this guy get wood and water in his hands? Oh, he didn't. That's two different guys. <laughs> okay, we got two different guys here. So if I move this over, I should be able to get rid of that. Ah, perfect. Okay, that's what we were trying to do. So now I should be able to get one of these. Nope, not one of those. One of these. Up over here somewhere, hopefully, maybe not that far, something like this. 
but if I put some fuel in there, it should thaw out the sulfur. Look at this, we got we got seeds. Let's get these things fired up. Okay, we'll put those near the fire. I think actually something like this. Ooh, how are the guys gonna get in there to put that in there? Maybe they'll still be able to access it. I'm not sure. Where's my water guy? I need the water guy. Where are you? Come here. I got I got more plants that I need you to water now. It also seems like this sulfur spring just makes fuel. Uh, makes water. I mean, makes heat. Oh my god. There, that's the word I was looking for. So I don't have to actually worry about any of this area. It's gonna just heat itself automatically, which is great. I do need to get over here to grab this guy, though, I think. There we go. We can grab him. Let's bring him over here so he's useful. What is this? A spore? Okay, well, we'll take that just because we can. Um, we've got some mushrooms over here. All right, all right, all right. We got big bots coming up here soon. That's cool. What's this? Copper? This is all copper, copper, copper. Okay, let's... Unlock some new resources here. Execute a command center goal. Copper ingots. How do we make copper ingots? I'm assuming it's just a fire with copper ore. Yep, just a fire with copper ore. Now we're down to 384 fire. Why are these still not working? Sir, what are you stuck on? Drop to check plant, starving. Why are you stuck here? This plant should not be starving. All right, I've added on if on error. So if he tries to do it and can't, then he's gonna skip it and just go to the next thing. Hopefully that fixes the problem. Whoops. There we go. That should fix a lot of it. Perfect. We're gonna need more coal soon, I think. I'm gonna need another fire down here. Actually, wait, coal's not a problem. It's the soil that might become an issue. Although, we still have a lot. We still have a lot. Okay, so that's not a problem either. We don't really have a problem. Am I able to mine anything out of this or is this just to unlock a new heat source because it seems like that's all it's for at this point let's put that thing away and i guess what we'll do is just smelt these ingots it's kind of annoying having fire all the way down here but it's gonna work for now. Okay, how many of these do we need? 10, not gonna have enough. So we're going to need to expand. Let's put this in here. We got another little buddy and some more copper. Let's finish off this level and see what it unlocks for us. Okay. There we go. What did we get? A steam bonfire. Steam batteries. Okay, steam bonfire and steam battery. What does this do? Looks like it heats up a huge area. New object. Steam bonfire. What is this thing up over here? I kind of want to see if that'll do it. We'll put a steam battery in there. Wow. That fires up things. What is this brewery? What is this? How do we thaw it out? Do I need to move this? Probably. I'll get some... What do I want? One of these? Put one of these in here? Or is that... Maybe that's not even big enough. Maybe we gotta thaw the whole thing at the same time. I don't know. We'll just put this in here and we'll see what happens. Let's get some wood in that thing. There we go! We unlocked the brewery! I don't know what that's supposed to be for. Oh my gosh, what do we have here? 
Receive circuit chips. Circuit chips are... Where are circuit chips? I don't even see them on here. It seems like we haven't unlocked them yet. Do we have to just find them? I don't see any. Uh, what's that? Moss. That's a bark. Another brewery. Another brewery. I'm not seeing chips. Weird. How... How are we supposed to do that? Maybe I gotta get these things out of the way. Is that better? Uh, we can make these now. Copper and plates makes tanks. And then tanks and water makes steam batteries. Steam batteries seem pretty good. This thing's got a pile of fuel. And it heats up a massive area. So we might have to start cleaning up our... Cleaning up our fire situation here in a bit. I think it might be pretty close to time to do that. I also need... Where's my little fuel guy? Why aren't you... I need you to compare the count in this thing. And then drop in there and drop in there. Okay, I want you to keep that thing nice and full. Otherwise, we're going to run out of fuel. Okay, we can make heads, light bulbs, and iron ingots. That'll allow us to get rid of these two chest pieces that we have. A uh, light bulb. Like that. And an iron ingot should make us a head. And if I put those together, we make ourselves a robot. Okay, let's combine all of that and combine that with this. We got ourselves another robot. Okie dokie, that looks good. So we could actually make more of these guys now if we have to, right? We can make bodies as well. Yes, we can make bodies as well. So we can get this going crazy here right away. Perfect. We can make bodies, we can make heads, we can make craft mates. These guys require steam engines. Oh. Oh. We can make cargo bodies. How much stuff can these guys carry? Let's make one. Let's just do it. Okay, we're gonna need a battery, which I should have an extra one. We need a battery and what does it take? An iron ingot. And then we're gonna need a steam engine or steam battery. Come on, why can't I pick this up? Okay, we make a cargo body. And then to make a cargo head, we need a regular head, which is a light bulb. Make a light bulb. Make a head. And what did it take? Copper? Not a problem. I have some copper. So we can do this. We got a cargo head. Okay, and then if I put these together, we have a cargo mate. And what's the situation here? How much can these guys carry? Uh, pick up. Craft mates can carry up to two objects at a time. But this is not a craft mate, is it? Cargo mate? How much can cargo mates carry? It doesn't say. Cargo mate classes fishing cargo mate and melto mate. Hmm. I'm not sure how to tell what the difference is. If you know what the difference is, drop me a comment. Let me know. But guys, I think in the next episode we gotta clean up our productions and maybe get rid of these bonfires. I might actually just cancel everything I might just cancel everything that we've got going on right now and just start with a clean slate maybe um 
We're, we got a pile of robots that we can use. I want to keep the storages kind of out of the way because it's making my robots have to go on really long adventures that I don't want them to have to do. Why does it say the game is paused right now when it is clearly not paused? Okay, there we go. So, yeah, for example, these guys that are trying to get stone have to go all the way around here. And really, uh, this should just be in a different spot, I think. <laughs> it should just be in a different spot. But anyway, we got some work to do. I think it's going to be fine. We'll figure it out. If you know anything about the cargo mates, drop me a comment. Let me know. But other than that, guys, I think we're going to wrap it up right there for today. I hope you're liking the series so far. If you are, don't forget to leave me a thumbs up on this video. Subscribe to my channel if you're new here. And I will see you next time.